deep cavern bat, please. Yes, thank you. All right. So, watch him have three sunfalls. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> the shuffler is so fine. What up, brothers and sisters, and welcome to MTG Malone with me, Match Malone. Thank you also very freaking much for tuning in. Great news! If you haven't heard it on Twitch yet or on YouTube during my live stream, I tried to make affiliate in a week, and I did it in two days. Two days! That is amazing. I don't even know what to say. And uh, yeah, I want to thank you all, like uh, everyone that was here during the live streams on YouTube and especially on Twitch, in this case, especially on Twitch, because you know, it helped me get the affiliate status very, very freaking quick. So yeah, I was awake until 1 in the morning doing all the things so that we could, you know, enjoy the affiliation status together today. And we did. Like, not yet. I didn't yet, but, you know, past me did. Or future me will have done it when you see this video. Yeah, that is, that is how it is. And talking about celebration, there's a lot of new members on YouTube that joined. Um, most of them are already on the list, the others were like this morning, I saw it this morning, so I couldn't put him on the list yet, because I had to walk the dogs, eat, shower, all of that shwang before I stream. So yeah, uh, let's welcome some people, Puma Perez, Johan Herschel, Yara MMO, Shinnen, Brandon Charts, Ian McKenzie, thank you so very freaking much for becoming Zed to the Great Hearted, and Exodex. Thank you so very freaking much for rejoining as a gold span freaking dragon. Gold span dragon. I really freaking appreciate it from the bottom of my heart. But enough with the yammering. Where is it? Let's get into the what a fun guy hammering. We're playing a fungus deck. That is why. It's a fun guy. So, it's power and toughness are each equal to the number of fungi and or saplings that you control. So, that means he himself will always be a 1-1 one -one because he's an elder fungus. So, yeah. Elder fungus. It's... I don't even want to talk about that part. At the beginning of your end step, you create X fungi. These ones right here uh, can't block 1-1s. One um... That, uh, you know, equal to the number of times that you descend it. So if you, like, discard a land or mill yourself or whatever, and now you have, like, put 10 permanents in your graveyard, now you will make yourself 10 fungi, and this dude will become an 11-11. And that is pretty darn freaking good. And we have a lot of ways to mill ourselves. We are playing the Death Bonnet Sprout. Well, let's get over the new cards real freaking quick. Um, the Death Cap Marionette is a new card that is also fungus. You may mill yourself two cards. If you have your Mika Tyrant out, you absolutely want to do this. And uh, that is all for the new cards that mill yourself. Apart from the Bitter Triumph, because you can also use the Bitter Triumph to discard a card. If it is a land, well, you can use that to get a permanent into your graveyard. Do it during your turn though, otherwise you know you're a little bit screwed. Uh, other ways we do it is with Death Bonnet Sprout, that is also Death Bonnet Hulk Smashers. At the beginning of your upkeep, you mill a card. Then if there are three or more creature cards in your graveyard, you may transform him into the freaking Hulk. This fungus then turns into Fungus Horror. And uh, at the beginning of your upkeep, you may exile a card from a graveyard. And if a creature was exiled, you put a counter on it, which is pretty darn freaking tasty. Um, other creatures that mill ourselves are the Undead Butler. When it enters, you mill three cards, but when it dies, you can exile it from your graveyard to put a creature card from your graveyard to your hand. So if you mill something that you don't like, you can get it freaking back. Um, what else? We have Old Rootstein here. That mills your card every single turn and uh, when it enters the battlefield, and depending on what it is, a creature or a land or a non-land, um, non-creature, you get a treasure, a blood or an insect token. So, we still have more sauce in this deck. We have the Deep Cavern Bat. I, I tried some versions on stream, maybe you've seen it, and the Deep Cavern Bat changed it to the freaking better. So the Deep Cavern Bat, pretty darn freaking good. Just, you know, getting their freaking board wipes out of your hand, because if they sunfall you, you might be a little bit sad. We have the Canker Bloom, because it's a fungus, and it can destroy artifacts and shamans, but also proliferate, which might be good, like, you know, if you have, like, for example, the, um, I don't know, the counters on here, or the counters from the teachings. I also forgot the key teachings. It enters, you mill three cards, you create a spirit, 
then you put a count on a creature that you can proliferate in the worst case, you know, and you can exile it uh, to bring it back as the Kirin, well, it exiles itself to come back as the Kirin, makes a spirit, or it puts counters on something depending on what you freaking exile. So, Seed of Hope also mills you two cards, and then you may put a card that you milled if it's a permanent into your hand, and you gain two life. A Verge of Persistence, removal, bit of triumph, removal, but later on, you know, it also helps you to, you know, get the creatures back. And also, just so you know, Boseju and Takenuma also both get discarded into your, uh, into your graveyard, so that will also make you fungi. And that is also why we're playing Argoth as a one-off, because during our turn, if we don't have nothing to do, we need a mana sink, for four mana we can just mill ourselves, and, you know, you mill yourself three cards, there should be at least one permanent, because we have almost only permanents apart from this and from this. So you will be able to, you know, get yourself some more fun guy. Zyatora also in here, so you can cycle it, but also, because of two special sauces, well, only one special sauce is Zyatora's Proving Ground, it's a Kalistel Sword. Maybe you want to throw your Mika Tyrant into your opponent's face. And if you can do that, well, that is very darn freaking good, you know? And if you attack with all of your fungi, they block some of them. Now you can play the Kalisel Sword as a creature. And it will, you know, give you the possibility to just have a very, very big creature. And then later on with the second one, throw it in their freaking face. And then we have the Skyfisher Spider. The Skyfisher Spider is just amazing. You sacrifice one of your creatures and now you can destroy a target non-land permanent. And when it dies, you may exile it from your graveyard and again a life equal to the number of creatures in your graveyard. Which is pretty good against Mono Red. So yeah, once more. The deck is super fun. I had a lot of fun. We also have a Restless Cottage just in case we need to get in for the damage. Remember, this is Trample. So yeah, a very, very fun guy freaking deck. Make certain to join the streams. I will be here from Wednesday to Saturdays, noon to 6 uh, p.m. and uh, freaking Germany time. So uh Central European time, so whatever is your time zone, maybe check it out yourself. And I will see you there, my friend. And please remember that I match small. I almost said the ending already. I don't know why. I, I don't know why I said the ending thing already. Almost. I'm fired. Oh no, just just to spend it without pay. Well, in that case, I can also stay here and just work for free. So thank you so very freaking much. This is what a fun guy. I match Malone, and we'll see you in those fungal games. All right, all right, we're up against Ruby Warlock. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> that was just too good. Okay, we're going first. We're finally going first. Where is Evil Malone? Right here, Kribus. Yes, my friend. You could finally show up. Also, Handy Capable. Thank you very freaking much for the follow. I really appreciate it. Man. <clears throat> Yo, see you later. You're a lot of toxic, and we're up against Mono Red, finally. It had to happen sooner or later, you know? Sooner or freaking later. Let's go with the Deep Cavern Bat here first. See what they have. Um, I'm getting rid of the play with fire. If they want to invest all of their mana to get this uh, Monastery Swift Spirit down, I think that that is all right. Yo, Mad Mag, thank you very freaking much. Yeah, he had he had to he had to for a rod priest. That is like there is not even a question about it, not even a question about it. Okay, canker bloom coming down is pretty darn good. Pretty darn freaking good. So let us see if they have all the sauce. If we can get cut some slack. They're really doing this. Okay, alright. I mean, you do that, my friend. So. The etching is a, an uh, enchantment still. So we can still, you know, get rid of that. Blocking here like this. It doesn't matter, because I'm second it anyway, so it doesn't really matter, you know? What? Okay. I wonder why they did that. There's really no reason for me that they did it. But with the spider, we can get rid of the, uh, of the Monastery Swift Spare later, you know? 
Okay, all right. So. And here's another butler. Mills were fine, I like those, not gonna lie. So I think they will be going with the squee, yeah, 100%. I was like, why shouldn't they, you know? So we get back one creature here now. What are we getting back? Uh, I think it is the Mika Tyrant, of course. Alright, we're doing things, you know, we're doing things. We're up against Mono Red and we're not like totally useless, you know, I love that for us. I really do freaking love that for us. So you get out of here. Uh, let's get back our Canker Bloom, because you never freaking know. I don't think that we need to Boseju you as a, as a land, you know? I love this song so much. I love this song so freaking much. Okay, alright. Yeah, you do that, my friend. Couldn't care less, to be honest. Could not care less. A decline. Okay, what in the tarnation is this? All right. I need to make a decision here. Need to make a decision here. I think this is fine. I think this is fine. We can take one more hit here. I could even block it, you know? If they really found another shock here, it will be a slightly sad game. Slightly sad. Uh, for me, it's now 1 uh, p.m. So they're going with the... Um, they're going with the freaking squee here, I think. Yep, okay. Are you attacking in, though? If they're attacking in, I'm all for it, you know? But this is a fungus, though. Doesn't matter. Getting rid of it is absolutely uh, absolutely important. Old Rutstein. That also means that I can do this for two, right? All right, mill me some good stuff. All of it was perfection. All of it was freaking perfection. I will be chilling here for now. Jeez! Are we really playing against Mono Red or am I are my eyes deceiving me? That is right, Mono Red! Oh you have been pe beaten by freaking fungi man! By freaking fungi man! Oh baby! That felt good! That felt freaking amazing! We're up against Musashi Miyamoto! Ohio! Like, our going first rate with this deck is inexistent, man. Inexistent. We just don't go first. It's just not happening. Alright, but we do have something to do on turn two, so that is at least something. Yo, Mauro, how you doing? The fairy. I don't like that one single bit. Not one singular freaking bit. How much has it had Ward 2? That is a lot. That is a lot. Alright, so they do have a counter spell, which I really don't like. Um, let's get the land for now. If I draw a land here, I will be slightly saddened. No, I don't. Okay, perfect. So I am attacking in. Let's play Rotstein first. They do have counter spells and they want to use them. They better use them, dear. Yep, okay, all right. That's what I thought. That is what I thought. Um, Death Cap Marionette. Take action, yes. Ooh, all these spiders. Really not what I wanted here. Not what I wanted to mill here. 
But I do have another one in hand, so it is still alright, you know? So let us see what they're doing next. That wasn't also the best mill ever. But hey, we, we have enough of everything, you know? Alright, let's try the spider. Just as a blocker. Just as a freaking blocker. We really have them all. Really have all the freaking counter spells. Okay, all right. So we'll be getting rid of um going to be in Manila. Yo, that is amazing. That is pretty cool, not gonna lie about it. That is pretty cool. Kaito, okay. Alright. That gives me a chance to play the freaking Mika Tyrant. That is pretty good. I like that a lot. Um I can exile the marionette. There is no problem there. Okay. Make a tyrant coming down. Sadly, there was no, like, you know, card I discarded here. But I mean, hey, we're beating those fairies up, you know? Pretty hard, even. Pretty freaking hard, even. Oh, well, this is on the stack. Let's pay three life. Do this now. It's the Backstreet Boys, the best band ever, man. Backstreet Boys are back, man. Backstreet Boys are back. Okay, all right. So, we will see what they're doing here. We still have another bit of Triumph in hand. Did we mill another one, I think? No, we didn't. There was another game. Okay, go for the throat. Interesting. Um, What can I get rid of? I think old Rothstein. Like, we need to build, like, you know, we need to go in there. We really, really need to. Pay three life. Okay, yes, I'm certain. And exile that later. I mean, we're threatening lethal here next turn. Pretty darn good, you know? Kick me. <laughs> you can try. You can try and kick me. But I will always be here, my friend. This is my world now. This is my world. So by the way, who's going to uh, who's going to uh, Barcelona? All right, we're looking good here. I like it. So they might have like a um, flash fairy, you know, or they have nothing. Oh, you try to counter me. You try to fly over my head, but you know what? I was born in the graveyards of Golgari, man. That was my first ever deck. Here it is. I always have it lying around. Always just to show people that they're nothing in the eyes of Golgari. We're up against Foxy. Also, happy birthday, Foxy Grandpa. Happy birthday. Okay, opponent's going first again. Like, did we go first? We did go first once, right? One single game. And that is it. I like the hand. It's a little bit slow right now, but as long as you don't mono red going first, we should be fine. They're not. Okay, Seed of Hope seems good here. Don't go for the call, girls. <laughs> you can get them anywhere. You don't have to go to freaking Talia. Okay, all right. Um, we need to land, actually, sadly. Sadly, we do. Okay. We're getting back uh, rid of this first. So they're legends. Which is slightly annoying, but not the end of the world annoying. Absolutely not. I love this song. Yo, Liquid Monkey, how you doing, my friend? How are you doing? I hope you're doing well. So, what do I want to do here? Well, first of all, let's get rid of their Shadred. I hate it. I don't want it around. Shadred, you need to go. Now we bring down the little Sprout. So... I can feel the pain. 
Jeez, what a top deck, man. What a top deck. Jesus Christ, that was bad. That was pretty bad. Oh no. Well, I mean, hey, we're still in the game somehow, you know, but it's going to be tough. The Mika Tyrant. Well, at least it's an okay blocker, you know? At least we have an okay blocker now. And we do have the teachings, we do have the Seed of Hope, so we can mill ourselves a lot next turn. We will see, though. Yeah, Rafin is pretty good, you know, especially if you top deck it after I took away everything you owned. Especially then it's pretty darn good, you know? <laughs> especially then. <laughs> Man, oh, I'm sorry I beat you. I'm sorry. <laughs> Kinda. <laughs> um, let's chill for now. He threw away Skrelf. So. This combo is so beautiful. I love every single thing about it. Let's mill here first, see if we can get a land. I can get a land. Beautiful. Freaking beautiful. Okay, here's the teachings. So now we even have a freaking blocker, which is super darn good. I love it. I freaking love it. Okay. I don't want to block with this anyways. Do you think they have an A-Gun, yo? Urtai? Jeez, come on, game. Come on. Now what are you destroying? My Mika Tyrant? It's going to be the Tyrant, isn't it? It is going to be the Tyrant. Everybody stop decking like a true world champion here! I mean, it's not really top decking, you know? As much as it is just... I mean, but that also means that our Mika Tyrant will be growing very, very big here. Very darn freaking big. Okay, alright. So. Shadrid is here now. Super annoying, but they cannot be attacking him with everything anymore. They can only attack in with the Rafine if they want to be safe, you know? That's the only thing they can be attacking in with. Alright. Your Shelly super darn annoying here, but it is what it is. So they gotta land. I'm drawing here, of course. Another land? Nah, man. Not cool, game. Not cool. Okay. Just not cool. Alright, Takanuma, though. Pretty darn good. Is it even worth to attack in with these? Not really, right? Not freaking really. Do you really draw a cutdown now as well? It is the Aganjo. It is the Aganjo. Man, this is so bad for us right now. They will be getting rid of my uh, Mika Tyrant. Just so bad for us right now, not gonna lie about it. They cannot be using their Plaza of Heroes, so that is already very good. Wait, I'm just dead here! Yeah, that was... <laughs> that was very well by our opponent. Very well played by our opponent, you know, very well played. I mean, hey, it is what it is. You win some, you lose them all. We're up against Hino! He who knows. <gasps> Krimus, there was the wrong button, where is it? Krimus! Yes, I have to change the buttons, right? You will have to do it, even Malone. You will have to do it. I like the hand, though. Even though we have only untapped lands, but hey, it is what it is. 
Well, we do have a Bozeju, so that is also all right. <laughs> that is also all right. I'll thank you all for 135 people watching. I really appreciate it. Once more, if you are on Twitch, maybe you want to check out the Twitch stream as well. Yo, editor, cut out everything at the beginning here. <laughs> it was just me waiting for two minutes. Okay, all right. So, what are we up against? Another Golgari connoisseur, okay. So, uh, I will be bringing down the Death Bonnet's Brute here. So, what are you doing? Are you cutting down... Oh, you're Phyrexian? Oh, you're a fight rigging deck. Well, I will have to keep this one up then. You go ahead and do that. Just, just destroy it straight up. Couldn't care less about it. I don't even have my big fungus guy out right now, so it doesn't even really bad. Okay, all right. That is that is bad. That is bad. That is really really bad. Yo, Pantera is amazing. I cannot believe that we're like glam metal hair almost. You know. Greetings from Spain, yo, gracias. Really appreciate it, my friend. My Spanish sadly is super bad, so don't don't quote me on that. All right, let's attack in. They will not be blocking anyways. Maybe they're thinking about it, but I don't think that they will. Live by the bad diver. Indeed, man. Indeed. That is true. That is absolutely true. So let's play the butler first. I also, our land situation is a little bit crazy. If you remember that we didn't draw lands before and now we're here drawing only lands. It goes one, two, three, four. Yeah. <laughs> one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight lands in the first 13. That is exactly what you want. That is exactly what you want. So maybe they missed Lance, you know? Maybe they did. They did not miss Lance. Okay. Jeez, okay, game. All right. This is super good, though. Oh, they are missing Lance. They're missing Lance. I like that. Okay, all right. But let's get rid of the bat now so that we do have the removal. Um, There is nothing in here, right? There's another undead butler. Okay, let's get the undead butler then. So, what is what is going on here? <laughs> what is going on here? Okay, so now comes a shock or what? I'm so confused. Like they chose Phyrexian here. Now they have red in the deck. What is going on? What is going on, man? Only lands, yeah. That is that is what is up, man. That is what is up. Subscribe to my only lands. So what is going on? I would really love to know what is happening. Glissa Sunslayer. Okay, all right. Doing this now. Um, passing the turn. Like, I can get back my Tyrant here, which is super darn good. I love that for us. I will just block this Glissa for now. Like, there's literally no reason to do anything else. And getting the Tyrant is pretty darn good. Alright. Like, there's literally no reason to block here. Yes, we're taking three, but that is still alright. Take action, yes, please. Can you see this? <laughs> Can you see the amount of lands in here? <laughs> Thank goodness we have our little sprout that is really helping us out here, you know? Very much even so. Very freaking much even so. So, we will see though. They found another land. Slightly annoying, but not the end of the world annoying. And that is it. Okay, all right. Bit of triumph sucks though. Bit of triumph freaking sucks, though. So the sprout will have to go soon. What I will be doing, though... Getting rid of this, so that we get at least one little dude out of this, you know? Of course they do. Of course they do have it. 
Why shouldn't they have it, you know? Why shouldn't they have it? All right. So, we do still have answers, though, so that is still all right. Yagmoth, all right. The drawing here. I mean, Gix, not Yakmoth. <laughs> yeah, Untap for some reason is not working right now. Just not freaking working right now, which is a little bit annoying. But there's also like nothing I can do about it. Another spider was milled. Now also this. Are you taking a trade? I mean, I would love that if you did. Would really freaking love if you did, my friend. Not gonna lie. Not gonna freaking lie. If you want to take that trade, I'm all freaking for it. They don't. They don't want to take the trade. All right. Ending the turn here. They have their own Terra Sunder. Well, that is fine with me. That is freaking fine with me. All comes down to what they're doing next, you know? Jeez, what a game. <laughs> what a freaking game here once more, man. If they're just attacking in with everything... I mean, they're dealing themselves so much damage. Let us see what they can even do, you know? I think we got this. It all comes down to what they're playing now. But they need to play at least two creatures. At least freaking two creatures here. If they cannot do that, we win. Out of nowhere, man. Alright, so... Nixilis. Families call me their adversary. I oh, I lose. I lose to the Obnixilis. I lose to the Obnixilis. I lose to the Obnixilis. Wait, what? Why did you do that? Why didn't you just... Why didn't they just discard here? Do you think they have another removal in hand? If they do have another removal, we just lose. If they don't, we're going all in here. We're going all freaking in here. They need exactly a removal in hand. If they don't have it, we win. If they have it, we lose. All comes down to this. But they already threw away the game once, so yeah. Do you have it? <gasps> we won! Boom! What? <laughs> they threw away the game, though! They threw away the game, though, man, by making themselves a devil instead of just making me discard! I had no business winning this game! Thank you, my friend! I appreciate it, Mr. Hino MRR. MRA. I really appreciate it! Thank you for the free win! Thank you! That was a game we had no business winning at the end. Like, really no business at all. Like, none whatsoever. <gasps> My Lord Krimus! Yes, Krimus! Okay, all right. That was devilish. Oh, Gilga, how you doing? Good morning to you as well, my friend. Good morning to you as well. It was about time. Well, we played against Mono Red before, so it's, it's not the first time this is happening. Okay. What can we get here? Take action, yes. Oh, of course. <laughs> of course. <laughs> Those were way too good of a mill. Oh my lord, okay, alright. 
I mean, yeah, get your one card, my friend. Get your one card, I hope it's a land. It is a land, okay, beautiful. Freaking beautiful. Well, what are we milling here? All the Mika Tyrants, okay. Not happy about that. Not really happy about that, but hey. Godric, okay. Yo, Baked Fries! Thank you very freaking much for the follow, I really appreciate it. So let us see what we mill first. More bats, more good stuff. Alright, but I really, really need to get rid of this. So somehow we're still in this. I don't know why and how, but we're still in this. Uh, we need two more lands for the Virtue of Persistence, and then this game will be going crazy, man. Crazy. Baked fries! I had made some fries myself yesterday. Like, completely homemade. Like, I, I wash the potatoes, I put them in like a machine that you push down and then there poops out some fries, you know? It was pretty darn cool. Let's do this now. There's a bear. There is a bear. I have bears now. Are you shooting my bear? You shooting my face? You do you, my friend. You do you. You do you. You uh, do you. We're still on 14. I don't think that that is what they envisioned when they played when they started playing this game. Okay, all right. I'm taking three here for once now. Yeah, yeah, that is kind of what I expected. Not gonna lie. Not gonna lie. Yo, funny man! Thank you very freaking much for the follow. I really appreciate it. Let's do this now. Get the sprout. Passing the turn. I will throw this away if I have to. We will see what they're doing here. Sock and sun, okay. All right. As to blockers. All right, discard a card because I don't want to lose more life here. So, this proud is doing work now. Teaching super good. I like it. We have to start attacking in now. Let's we'll see if they have more god rigs. Yo, Ataka, thank you very freaking much for the follow on Twitch. I really appreciate it. Yo, Madam Thoughtness, thank you very much. I also appreciate the follow. Uh, the, the, the good day, I mean, not the follow. The good day. <laughs> I really appreciate it. Oh, that is smart, though. Kinda, you know? Kinda smart, though. All right. Block in here so that we mitigate the damage slightly. What am I getting back though? What do we even have in here? Well, the tyrant is the best idea, I think. Ooh, the spider though. Spider is pretty good. Spider is pretty darn good. Let's get rid of the bloodthirsty adversary. I need a blocker here. If they do have a removal for this, that is fine. But the spider will give us back a lot of life. Okay, that is fine with me. They do have another one of those that is fine with me also. Uh, yes. Take action, thank you very much. Damn, this spider is so strong. So strong. Oh, you have a sacrifice effect. Oh, okay, well, I mean, that is, that is all right. I can live with that. 
two, four, five. I don't like living with this, though. Like, this straight up sucks. This straight up sucks. If they do have another one of those, I will be very saddened. Okay, alright. They keep on top. Nah, that ain't good for us. I mean, what am I supposed to do here? It started off so good, but it went down the drain real freaking fast. Really, really freaking fast, man. I really needed something to gain some life here. I really did. Maybe they forget that they can't block. Nope, okay. Yep. Destroyed by one furnace rain, man. One furnace rain got us too good. That got us too good. But the game was pretty good. I liked the game. It was okay. It was okay. Alright, last game with the deck. Whatever it is, we're taking it. But, uh, you know, it's just all these mono red players that can just go home. Oh my lord, Krimus! Yes, Krimus! Okay. I won't even play the Ziatora yet. All these mono red players can just suck it, man. Just suck it. Okay. So? Alright, Seed of Hope will be good here. I mean, I will be playing this deck until I lose the next time. And then if we lose one more time, we're good. We, we, we will be done then. Oh, Deep Cavern Bat, please. Yes, thank you. Alright. So, watch him have three Sunfalls. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> the shuffler is so fine. Mm -mm. So freaking fine, man. <laughs> so freaking fine, man. Just shuffler is all right. Nothing to worry about. Nothing at all. If they're bringing down the Jace here, I'm okay with that. Where's chat? Where's my chat? Here it is. Yeah, that's a lot of walkers indeed, man. <laughs> it's just... <laughs> Yo, hand banana! It's the best kind of banana. Alright, Field of Ruin coming down. And what else, though? They do have something. They do have something. I wonder what it is. Like, this is the kind of ridiculous game, you know, that I was waiting for still to happen. They're playing one of the Jaces. Alright. Thank you. Okay. No secret escape. I mean, I'm all for it, you know. I'm all freaking for it. Let's do some more of this. All freaking for it. So we haven't done the Callous Sword Mika Tyrant yet. That is saddening. Super saddening. But hey, it is what it is. They did find another land. We're playing the Wandering Emperor now. Okay, alright. Wait, what? Okay. You get out of here. <gasps> we found it, though. Let's get rid of um, the butler. We're getting rid of both here. And what am I getting back? Another deep cavern bat is the best thing here. If they want to get back their Celesta so bad, they can do it now. I don't care. I really don't care. See you later. Ending the turn. We could win next turn, you know? It's going to be a little bit tough, but we could win here next turn. If they now have a... There is a Wandering Emperor. Okay. 
They're exiling here now, which makes sense. But we do have a chance here. We do have a freaking chance here to see their hand. Jeez, that is three wandering emperors, my friend. Three of them. Chillax. <laughs> Chillax. <laughs> Freaking chillax, man. Okay, so um, this is only four. Like, even if I would attack in with this, it would be five. They go down to freaking seven. That is not enough. The cell sword isn't doing enough here. So, yeah. <laughs> chillax, man. <laughs> that is indeed a very greedy pile, man. A very greedy pile, but I mean, hey, it makes sense. You know, if you draw three wandering emperors in the first 14 cards. Pretty good, pretty good. <laughs> That's right. Jeez. <laughs> Malone versus the Shuffler. Get out of here, man. <laughs> We're up against Synergy. The master of energy. <gasps> Kremers. Yes. Shuffler is always the hardest opponent. That is true. That is absolutely true. So. <clears throat> Seed of Hope is always a good reason, you know? A recruitment officer, okay. Now let's get the butler. Let's get the butler. I think against this kind of deck we have an okay chance, not gonna lie. Not gonna freaking lie. Getting back the bats wouldn't be the worst thing here. So now watch him do the... Okay, alright. Fair trade. Fair trade. Absolutely fair trade. Uh, do I get the bat? Oh, there is only a bat. Okay, there is only a bat. Alright. Guardian of Nubanalia. So I really would like to find my... Um, Virtue against this guardian. That would be pretty darn good. Here you go, my friend. You are, you're holding priority because of this. They're holding priority because of their guardian. But that is fine. You know if their timer runs out now. Uh, the undead butler's name? Absolutely. Um, I don't know. Bob. Bob is good. Bob is absolutely what it is. All right. Is this a soldier? It is a soldier. We're doing this now. Here you go, my friend. Like, what is going on? Jeeves? You think it's Jeeves? Uh, I don't think it's Alfred. I mean, Alfred died during one of the recent runs, so it might... What? Why didn't you play the blue source? Oh, because... That is just what it is. Okay, I totally understand. I totally get it, game. Totally do freaking get it. That is just the way it's supposed to freaking be. Just the way it's supposed to freaking be, man. <laughs> just the way it's supposed to be. So we're now in never finding land territory. Which sucks, man. Oh my lord. First, they never play the game. Second, they top deck the exact card I'm stealing from them. What an annoying opponent. <laughs> what an annoying opponent, man. <laughs> All right. Good. Good. I like it. it. Just, I mean, I'm sorry. I have to spam. I have to spam. Yeah, it's Bob the Butler. Bob the Butler is fine. It sounds like, you know... A goofy kind of butler anyways. It's time for a snoozahedron. It's time for a freaking snoozahedron here. Like, what is this? Well, like, what is this, man? Would you please, like, play the game? Just at least once in your life? Okay. Thanks. Freaking thanks. So. Here's the frontliner now. Still taking three, which is alright. But now we also have like a blocker here, which is pretty darn good. Jesus Christ, man. Jesus Christ, man. I 
I hope that we draw. I really, really hope that we draw a freaking virtue just so I can get rid of this Garden of Benalia because this is going a little bit far, man. A little bit far, you know? There's no reason for you to do this. None whatsoever. Maracuya, thank you very fucking much for the follow. I really appreciate it. Jesus Christ, you don't have anything in hand, man. You're just being annoying. <laughs> What is going on, man? What is going on? Okay, so, stop on the upkeep here. Uh, discarding a card is going to be the cell sword because I don't think that we ever need it. Resolve. Jeez. Tell me you're the most annoying person without telling me that you're the most annoying person. There, you could have just countered it. Yo, Liz, bro! Thank you very freaking much for the follow. I really appreciate it. Arbin, okay. All right. Yo, Mythic Maria! Thank you for very much for the follow. No blocks. Can we please find a land here? Not off the top. Not off... Nah, man! Okay, well, still fine. Still fine. All right. So. I will have to sacrifice this sprout here. My lord. <laughs> My lord. <laughs> what are you doing, opponent? What are you doing, man? Okay, all right. So. Let us hope they play a land. They have another Harbin, okay. Understandable. Does it get plus one or does it get only plus one O? Oh. Plus one plus one, right? Is that how it works? Uh, power only, okay. All right, that is fine, I like that. Because they will be discarding their last card here. Now I can freaking destroy it. Take action, yes. Another land. Annoying, but not the end of the world annoying. But we can finally get rid of this. No more holding priority for our opponent. Okay. Freaking finally, man. Freaking finally, man. There was seven minutes of us just watching our opponent. Doing nothing, man. And they're still going on doing nothing. Alright, there was also three lands in a row. This one, the one we drew before, plus this. So we should be able to find something else, right? At least that's my dreams and hopes. Alright. Well, that is super good. I like it. Thank you very much. Hmm. I could destroy the Harbin, but give him something else in return. I don't really want to do that. I think this is still fine. I think that that is still fine. So we have a lot of cool stuff that we could still draw. So let's just hope for the best here. Hope for the best. I mean, yeah, I'm blocking this. And... Man, they're drawing so well. They're drawing so well. They haven't drawn a single land yet. They have not drawn a single freaking land yet. Not a single land since like 10 turns or something like that. And I've drawn a lot of lands here. Okay, pass the blocks like this here and like this here. Proliferate. If they now have a removal, I will be so salty. So freaking salty. Doesn't look like it though. If they now... Yo, Taisha! Thank you very freaking much for the follow on Twitch! 
Okay, they're drawing a card. That is good. That is good. That means they don't have anything. Are you joking, man? Come on. Oh, my lord. Oh, my lord. We're getting so flooded, man. So freaking flooded. What is this? Come on. Man, so unfair. Yo, Joyce, how are you doing? How are you doing? Like, man, come on. They like four lands and that was it. I mean, hey, you know, live streams are fun, live streams are good, that we enjoy them very freaking much. I want to give a huge shout out to everyone that just while I was asleep already subscribed to freaking Twitch. I really appreciate it. It was crazy. Like, I, I don't even know when it happened. It's already five subscriptions. I haven't even had a stream yet between not being affiliated and being affiliated. So yeah, when you watch this, maybe it will be already more, but it doesn't matter. I'm just doing it so that we can do all the Twitch things. I, I left my shutters open, that is terrible. I see people walking by all the time. I'm sorry, I'm getting sidetracked here. So yeah, the deck is pretty fun. Maybe you can cut the Kalisel Sword, it didn't do too much. Put in like one more cut down or something that gives you more life. Might be very darn freaking good. And for the rest, you know, it's a fun guy deck, you know, it's a... A freaking Golgari self mill with a splash of red, you know, just a little bit of burning passion inside of that deck. And that is exactly what we need sometimes. I want to give a huge shout out to my sponsor, Ultimate Guard, for, uh, you know, keeping the lights on. And of course, all of my Patreon members that just passed by on the list uh, for, you know, making it possible that we can keep on doing this every single day and now even stream and not worry about putting food on the freaking table. And please remember, my friend, to first off, Put a little what a fun guy down below in the comments. I would appreciate it very freaking much. And also, now I can say it. It's the time. Now, yeah, I'm just just checking with you know just uh, you know production back there. Um, if you're waking up tomorrow morning, there's a beautiful, beautiful face of yours in the mirror. That all of you are pretty freaking sweet. I'm Matches Malone, and I will see you all tomorrow.